can't. You didn't tell me the camera was on. I just said he had a big bar. Nah, nah, I turned it on after that. Oh. The man walking past, it looks like a big tall basketballer. Except he's got a big bum, so I said he wouldn't be a basketballer. Yeah, but he's black. Juicy. That's a juicy bum. <laughs> <laughs> I think juicy bum helps in basketball, Dave. Hey. Oh, yeah, Welcome to Car Radio. Car Radio. It's been I've a been, while. I've been having requests. Oh, really? Yes. Oh. Yeah, you know you've got it going on. Yeah. You get requests. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so now, what have we all been up to? Um, I went on a little trip to Oriwa. Yeah, in the car? Yeah, drove all the way to drove all the way Woo! to Orewa, from yeah. Wellington to Orewa. Where's Orewa? North of Auckland. Where's Wurt? And I say it again. Got it. Don't help him. Or don't help him. This is part of the fun. Where's Orewa? Say it again. <laughs> Orewa. Oh Orewa. my God. Orewa. 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 Ah. Orewa. Too many is better than not enough. <laughs> Orewa is north of Auckland and it's a beautiful, beautiful. place. Beautiful. I used to go there as a child every single holiday. We oh, went wow. There. It's where I went to swim. It's, yeah. Oh, my goodness. Yeah. Oh, it's, it's beautiful. Unlike yeah. Piha, it's like the anti Piha. You know how when you see um, res Rescue Piha, mm. Piha Rescue? Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. You'd never have Rescue Orewa because it's too pretty. Oh, it's beautiful, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, geez, it's lovely. Big giant beaches when the tide goes out. Beautiful. <coughs> sun comes up right there on the beach. It's I beautiful. forgot about the giant beaches when the sun goes out. Yeah. When the tide's out, that's enormous. It's enormous. I remember running as a kid. This is one of my favourite memories, Was and I've talked about this heaps, but seeing Oriwa over as you come up the hill and you can see it, uh -huh. I used to get so excited because I was from South Auckland. There wasn't a lot of beach happening in South Auckland. Yeah. And I'd see the water, and then we'd get to the place we were staying wherever, and then I would run and my little fat legs run to the water and sometimes when the tide was out it was a big run <laughs> <laughs> I was running for a long time oh, yeah, yeah. yeah oh, it gets up to about 100 metres man oh, it's amazing do you know sometimes I have like dreams that I used to babysit you Polly because you always you sound like the cutest little like little little monkey monkey little, in the world and I, I was cute you. I, I was a cute this is so funny and it's funny because Tim my partner says and Grant will agree I'm sure you are five years old. Like you are actually five years old. I am five years old. Like, yeah, you are. Yeah. You, you got to five and you stopped, eh? Yeah. Yeah. That was it. You got taller though. That was what I got taller. I got bigger. <laughs> Although you were pretty tall I was, as a young kid. I was. At five I was up in the pictures, <laughs> at school pictures with the boys in the back and I was in the middle. Ah, yeah. I was, I was tall, but I, I'm, I am at five. I'm like... A perpetual sort of like big toddler, really. Yeah, yeah, that's true. That's uh, that's fine though. Well, so you're sort of like you're, I'd say you're seventy five. Yeah, you you're, know, and we, I think we've talked about this before, but um, I don't have an inner child. I have an inner old man. You have been seventy five so, since I met you. Yeah, you I know. have an inner old man, and my outside is more childy, childy. <laughs> it's quite funny. You were nineteen <laughs> when I met you, but you were seventy five. Yeah. And I was five. Ooh. Ooh. Dave, see, I think you're perpetually like 14. Yeah. Like 13 or 14. What does perpetual mean? I mean, all the time. Oh, yeah, that's you're cool. All the yeah. time, 13 yeah. 14. So it's a good balance here. You're we've been got, fun. We've got a little yeah. kid, a teenager who can babysit me, <laughs> and an old man who could say, You kids, get off my grass. Get off my grass. <laughs> yeah. Don't you think Dave would have been fun though as a 13 year old? Dave's fun as a 23 year old. Yeah, that's true. Very fun. <laughs> How's the new job going, Dave? Oh, oh yeah, how's it going? Oh, that's pretty good. Yeah, yeah. pretty good. Some, yeah. some really, really good people. Are but they nice to you? Yeah, they're Aww. real nice. And do you know that they... Dave's got a job. <laughs> they also don't do their dishes there. Oh. What do you mean? Well, they don't do their dishes. So Who like, does them? I'm not sure, but I don't have to do my dishes at the new place. I just what? put it on the bench. Is there no big sign like they, there was at our old work that said, I don't know why you pigs think you can treat your own home like a pigsty, <laughs> but don't treat the workplace like a pigsty. So you don't have that? No, they just put it wherever, so I put it wherever, wow. and then there's and all these dishes that are there. It's real cool. That's and so cool. You come back in the morning and they're clean? Uh, or are they always dirty? They're always dirty. Oh. You just keep adding. Are you sure you're not at a student flat? You're actually at a workplace? <laughs> well, I'm not sure. Has it got like a sign on the door or something? <laughs> well, they've got a code that you have to press. Oh, right? okay, codes. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah. 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 Oh, okay. Uh, well, I have been, um, I haven't been away, mm. but I have been, um, watching a lot of Netflix and eating a lot of chocolate and I don't fit 75% of my clothes anymore. Yeah, unemployment's not good for you. Or for you me. Wait. I don't know yeah. about you, but for me I'm not sort of, I'm not staying lean. 
Dave, Dave's got a personal I'm trainer. Oh, what? Um, what? Really? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Is that part of your part of your contract? Nah. No, oh. he's paying for it himself. It's because oh, I'm wow. a, bit, a bit chunky. Did you know this? You know, have you, have you guys seen Guardians of the Galaxy two yet? No. Oh my god! Awesome. Best sequel ever. Have really? you seen it, Dave? No, I don't like superhero movies. Neither oh, do no. I. I hate them. Did you see the original Guardians of the Galaxy? No. <gasps> okay. It's so not like it. It's so not okay. like a superhero. Hold one. on for a second. Trust me, it's so not. Where was I going with this? Going to get it there. Chris Pratt. Chris Pratt. I've got to get the, the first story out. So Chris Pratt couldn't afford when he got cast for Guardians of the Galaxy. He was yeah. Fat Pratt then. That's what he calls himself. He was a chubby guy. But he got the role and he had to lose 30 kgs. And? He did it himself because he couldn't afford wow. a personal trainer. Wow. And his career has taken off since it's, then, hasn't it? But he says he misses wow. Fat Pratt and Fat Pratt will be back because his wife's <laughs> such a good cook, Anna Faris. Oh, she's cool. But, but he paid for it himself. That's the thing is, you look at these actors and you think, oh, you know, they're really rich and stuff. But before he got Guardians of the Galaxy, even though he'd been in Parks and Rec and other movies and stuff, he couldn't afford a personal trainer. Wow. Wow. Yeah. Man. Um, Guardians of the Galaxy, better than the first one. The, the second one is better than the first one. Really? Yeah. We went to see Guardians of the Galaxy 2, right? And I took my partner and he's not, he's like you, he's not into superhero movies at all. He loved it because it's so funny. Oh, he'd never seen number one either. Never seen one. So we went and rented number one, and he went, well, number one's nowhere near as good as number two. Oh, that's saying something. Wow. And then our daughter Catherine saw it too, and she was like, you're right, number two's better. Oh, look, I love Catherine, and Catherine's editing the video here. But Catherine, whatever movie she sees next will be her favourite movie. <laughs> no, she started crying when the music started in this movie. I was with her. Really? Yeah, the movie started like this. The t- this title came up and she was like what the hell I just, she was six months pregnant so I thought we'd go through sequels what we think because I cannot think of any other movie by the way Kingsman 2 is coming out yeah oh yes of um, course I can't think of any movie with a second one other than this is better than the first. A lot of people say that Godfather 2 is better than Godfather 1. Incorrect. Godfather 1 was great but Godfather 2 man Robert De Niro <sighs> It was okay, but it was quite disjointed. No, I haven't seen them. No. You've never seen them? No. You've never seen Godfather? No, it's too old. Godfather oh, is confusing, though, because it's, it's meant to be old. set... No, it's meant to be set in the 30s and 40s, and they're wearing 70s hairstyles and stuff. Oh, that's... This is oh. me. Oh. Uh-huh. Yeah, yeah. It's called an anachronism. Anyway, mm-hmm. um, I can't think of any movies, but we, we've all got to think... Return of the King. That was a third one. Uh, oh, come on. Oh, come on. Oh, no! Uh, Perfect Two was so good. Pitch Perfect Two was shite. <laughs> it was so good. No, I watched it like say, four times. I'm going to say the word. Shit. Pitch Perfect. The first one is like A level. It's like A A level dope. But the second one is terrible, Dave. Hmm. Okay. Like no, it. no. Sorry. I'm sorry. I don't even remember. Sorry. I didn't see it. Oh, I'm man. stomping yeah, on sorry. your. I'm stomping on your Pitch Perfect Two. Okay. Okay. Um. You're going to go with Return of the King. Return of the King. Yeah. Come on. Return of the King. I mean, I, it's, I, know, I love the Fellowship of the Ring, and I love the Two Towers, but the Return of the King, come on. Okay. Give I'm it to so me, come I'm sorry on. this has suddenly turned into a really geeky uh, car radio. No. <laughs> Return of the King. However, the Star Wars, I think that, did you think that... Uh, Empire Strikes Back was, was better than... Jeez, uh, uh, re- Gillespie. It was so embarrassing. Okay. All of a sudden, my partner phoned in the middle of this. Okay, so the video, this is being taken off her phone. Okay, record it. Because I forgot the camera. But when that just cut off just a moment before, it's because the phone a phone call was coming through, and it said from Sex Machine to mm, Best Root Ever. He put it in the phone, not me. <laughs> but do you know what else he did? Do you know what else he did? He made it announce itself. So Siri says it out loud. So I'll be in That's the doctor's true. office or something. It'll go. Get on your tip. Sex machine team. Hmm. Best route Emma. Comes up oh, it loudly as my phone rings. I'm like, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, you nuns over there from Eskin. I'm sorry. Oh, wow, well, that was slightly God. embarrassing. No, it was funny. I loved yeah. it. I think, we were t- I think we were talking about movies, eh? Yeah. Oh, yeah. So. Um, it's very geeky. I wish they'd get really geeky, yeah, yeah. to say that. Uh, uh, yeah, yeah. Um, Empire Strikes Back was better than A New Hope. Okay, if we take out all the geek films. Yeah. Um, we left. No, Guardians of the Galaxy 2 is better than Guardians of the Galaxy 1. Back, Back to the Future? 
You are such a geek. What? Back to the Future 2, no. Which no. is the one with the cowboys and Indians? That's Back to the Future 3. That's best. Oh, really? Yeah, I like that one the best. Mm. What about yeah. Space Jam? Oh. I didn't know there was a sequel. There's not a sequel. I think it's coming out. I think it's a remake. That's a good point. Yeah. Is that or is it a sequel? I don't know. Wow. We should maybe do our homework before yeah, we come and do car radio. Yeah. Jeez. All so, right. Well, I, how do how long do we know that this was? Well, I know that there was. Look, I know it was going about seven or eight minutes before Best Rude ever phoned. <laughs> <laughs> now it's gone for another two I minutes. I don't even use that word. <laughs> It's a good word. <laughs> it's not, it's grim. Oh, it's I a hope, grim word. I hope Catherine, oh no. I was going to say, I hope beeped it out. No. <laughs> Catherine is worse than me. You mm. should have heard your children the other day. Oh my goodness. What? They told me, let's see, oh okay, no, it doesn't what? matter. Anyway. Can we save that for our next one? Okay, we've got to go. Jeez, you know what really is irritating about you? What? Just the way you walk, the way you eat. No, no. What is Everything. Talking, no, every, no. What is I'm talking about you is that you're so time conscious. Oh, Perhaps I am. Perhaps you've just got to let your mmm and your mmm float, you know, like a spirit. Okay. Stop talking. No. Bye. No. No. <laughs>